my new book is now on Amazon and it is available to buy. Today I'm going to talk about your parasympathetic nervous system and your sympathetic nervous system. So I have mentioned this in my new book because it's so incredibly important that we understand if we are chronically stressed out, your body can never ever heal. And we've been in a whole pandemic for months and months now and we've been living in the unknown which can be stressful we've got stress we've got anxiety we've got worry we've got fear and these are negative emotions which create the cortisol to rise up in your body which creates disease and illness and lowers the immune system and this is we where we have to try and switch on a parasympathetic nervous system which is your rest repair and relax and none of us are doing that and i'm saying none of us because i ain't doing it either sometimes and i'm a yoga teacher which is about breath and quieting down the mind and switching on our vagus nerve but unless i'm doing yoga i'm you know like an overachiever i want to be doing things i've just written a book i've just finished my pilates certificate you know i'm a goer i do things all the time so the parasympathetic nervous system has to be switched on and this is what I'm talking about in my new book as well. And there are ways to do it. One of them is through melatonin, which is your sleep hormone. You'll learn about that and how it can create the parasympathetic nervous system to work better for you. And also the switching on of your vagus nerve, which is your wandering nerve, which runs from your gut all the way up into your brain and other parts of the body as well. But that's the one that we want to mainly focus on. So you, there's different ways you can switch on your vagus nerve. And one of them is through the breath is so powerful and we're not using our full capacity for the breath. And without enough oxygen in your body, you get sick. And that's what we also need to be thinking about is how much oxygen are you getting into your blood to create healthy cells, to create a healthy bloodstream. We're not breathing properly. So to get that vagus nerve on also, you can hum, you can sing. Um, there are so many different ways to switch on the vagus nerve. So I'm covering a few of the ways in my new book. Um, the breath is just incredibly powerful. So whenever you breathe, when you breathe in through your nose, that's going to re-energize. And then when you exhale, you're getting rid of all your crap in your body, but it's the exhale that switches on your parasympathetic nervous system and the vagus nerve. So the exhale is incredibly, incredibly powerful. Um, and so with breath, you want to be thinking about, this is what I do sometimes in my yoga classes. So you breathe in for a count of four and you pause the breath and hold it and you hold it for a few seconds. And then on the exhale, you extend the exhale for about five counts. And then you can repeat for an inhale for four and then exhale for six inhale for four, exhale for seven. And this is a way to switch on that, that nervous, um, the vagus nerve and the parasympathetic system because if you're in that stressed out state, your hormones will be out of complete whack, all of them, because cortisol just takes over your body and it shuts down your digestive system and it lowers your immune system and stress can kill you.